What's this driver doing? Literally every green light. What is happening? Five forty five cent com traffic. Lomas and Locust out with Robert Mary Lincoln zero five four out of New Mex. It's a red Honda. Hello. Hello, I'm sorry. What's going on? Nothing. Okay, I'm Officer Savage State Police. The reason, okay. reason I stopped you is two reasons. One, you're stopped at every green light. Yeah. Did you know that? And then second, you just ran a red. So do you have your driver's license, man? Um, I do, I do. I'll take a look at that. Okay. Will you do me a favor? Yes. Will you place the vehicle in park? Perfect. And then I'm going to have you step out. I'll talk to you back here, okay? Okay. 545 signal. 545. Final stop is going to be Lomas in third. Right back here. Okay. Everything okay with your car? Yes. It's just beeping? Um, that's because my keys aren't in the car. Okay. Yeah. Did you not see the red? No. Okay. I'm sorry. I mean, you blew right through it. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm, I'm really sorry. No, I really didn't. Okay. Any any reason you're not paying attention tonight? No, no reason. Just just being stupid. No, okay. no reason. Did you see the green lights up there? No. Okay. I was... No, I just I just blew through it. I'm sorry. Like I was just being stupid. Okay. So I was behind you at right up there, right next to the interstate, Lomas and essentially Oak. Yeah. And at the first green light, it went green. Yeah. You sat there the entire time. I flicked my lights at you like five times. You would never moved. So you waited for the next cycle. It went red, then it went green again. I flicked my lights. You went then. Yeah. We got to the second green light. Same situation. It went green and you just sat there. I'm sorry. Yeah, you, no, I'm sorry. Like, I don't know why I didn't stop. I just, I have no idea. I'm sorry. Okay, where are you headed tonight? I was heading home. Okay. I left Marble. I was just going home. And home's at Clyburn? Yes. Okay. Any alcohol to drink? Yes. How much did you drink tonight? Two beers. Two beers? Yes. Okay. And what kind of beers are we talking? Um, the Cerveza. So Marble Cerveza? Yes. The uh, Marble Cerveza. Are we talking 12 ounce, 24, 30? 12. So, so two 12 ounce Cervezas. About how long ago was that? Not long. Not long ago? Not long ago. Pretty recent? Yes. Okay. Any reason you stopped in the road and not like a safe pull off or a parking lot or? Only because I don't know like... I don't know, like, how I'm, like, supposed to stop off with you guys. Honestly, okay. I don't stop off, like, you know, normally, so I just didn't know that it was supposed to be, like, a certain amount of time, like... Okay. Okay, I'm just I'm curious. So I'm sorry, like, no, I I should have stopped off, like, a, probably, like, a better part, but I didn't know, like, it was supposed to be, like, a certain amount of time. Okay. So, just off your driving behavior, 
um, your admission to alcohol consumption. I'm smelling it right now, odor of intoxicating alcohol beverage. I'm gonna run you through some tests to make sure you're safe to yeah, drive, okay? Fine. I just wanna make sure you're good to go. Um, right before I turned my police lights on, you almost hit a freaking curb. Did you know that? Yes. Any reason you did that? You're just not to be intoxicated and... Uh, were you texting or anything, or were you just... I was. I was texting my friends that I was at this location and that, you know, I was, like, you know, going to be home at this time, so... Okay. Clyburn's way up there in the Heights, right? Yes. Why are you going west on Lomas? I'm going west on Lomas because I live at Pennsylvania. I live at Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania and what? Like, what's your... I live in Pennsylvania. I live on um, Pennsylvania and Constitution. I just moved to those apartments. Okay. Those are my apartments now. So way up there. Yes. So you're going this way. Yes. Okay. Opposite direction of your house. <laughs> I'm trying to put it put it together. Okay. Okay. That's so fine. I'm gonna have you take your stuff off. You can just place it right up here on my hood. Take those glasses off for me. Do you see where my light is pointed? Yes. Right here, I'm going to have you stand on that light facing me, okay? <clears throat> so, I'm going to be going back and forth with my finger. I'm going to be looking at your eyes tonight, okay? okay? I want you to follow the tip of my finger. I don't want you to move your head at all. Okay. Do you have contacts in right now? Yes. Are they hard or soft? Soft. Do you do they change the color of your eyes or anything? Yes. They do change the color of your eyes? Yes. What's the natural color of your eyes? Gray. Okay. So, but they're not hard, right? They're, right. they're soft contacts? Yes, they're soft. Okay. Any recent head trauma? No. Traumatic brain injuries? Anything no. I need to know about? No, nothing like that. Okay. No. Like I said, I want you to focus on the tip of my finger. I don't want you to move your head. Okay. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. See my finger? Don't move your head, okay? This one's gonna go up, okay? All right, Miss Do you have any injuries that I need to know about? No, sir. Any problems walking, turning, or balancing? No, sir. Nothing at all? No, sir. Okay. We're gonna, I'm gonna have you stand right here on my light facing this way, okay? Take a couple steps forward. I'm gonna have you stand right here so you're not on that downward grade, okay? You said no issues walking, turning, or balancing, correct? No, sir. Okay. So I'm going to have you picture about a four-inch wide line. That four-inch wide line is going to be about the width of your foot. It's going to go all the way straight down the sidewalk. Okay. Can you picture that four-inch wide line? Yes, sir. <clears throat> Can you hear me okay? I'm going to have you place your left foot on that four-inch wide line, just like this. You can go ahead and do that now. Now take your right foot and place it heel to toe touching in front of your left, just like this with your arms by your side. Go ahead and do that. Perfect, do not move, nope, go back. Right foot in front of your left, heel to toe touching, arms by your side. Heel to toe touching, your, your foot is pointed a little towards the street. Your left foot, if you would, place your left foot on that line. Left foot on the line, ma'am. Perfect. So do not move from that position. This is the starting position for the test. I don't want you to start or move from this position until I tell you to do anything else. Do you understand? Yes, sir. When instructed to do so, you're gonna do nine heel to toe steps. Yes, I'll demonstrate for you. One, two, three, but on your ninth step, you'll plant your lead foot. You'll do a series of small steps with your back foot. You'll continue down that line. Nine heel to toe steps. One, two, three. Now when I instruct you to start this test, ma'am, you're gonna focus on each step, looking down at your feet. You're gonna count each step out loud. You're gonna keep your arms by your side throughout the test. Once you start it, I don't want you to stop until you're completely finished. Yes, sir. Do you understand the instructions? Yes. Do you have any questions before we begin? No. Go ahead and begin, ma'am.
up their steps. Go ahead and stop and do the turn as I demonstrated. Complete your nine steps back, ma'am. Ma'am, you can stop. Stand on my light, facing me. Arms, arms by your side, feet together, toes touching. Next, I'm gonna have you balance on one leg, okay? Whichever leg you choose, it could be your left or your right. You're gonna pick it up off the ground. Whichever leg you choose, it's gonna be straight. Your foot is gonna be parallel with the ground. Your arms are gonna be by your side. You're gonna look at the tip of your toe and you're gonna count in one thousands until I tell you to stop. This, this is the demonstration. Be about 30 seconds, okay, ma'am? Yes, sir. Do you have any questions? No, sir. You understand what I want you to do? Yes, sir. Go ahead and begin. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 15,000, 16,000, 17,000, 18,000, 19,000, 20,000, 21,000. Go ahead and stop. Miss, I'm going to bring you right back over here where your ID is, okay? Yes, sir. Right back here, ma'am. Right over here. Place your hands up here for me. You're going to place this arm behind your back, okay? The time is 22.44 hours, okay? Yes, sir. So 10.44. What do you have in your mouth? Nothing. Lift your tongue. So at this time you're gonna be placed under arrest for driving while under the influence of intoxicating alcohol and or drugs. Take one step back for me. Widen your stance. 5.45, say go. Okay. 10.15, 10.47. On my watch, 22.44 hours. Mouth free and clear debris. Start me at 46. Yeah. Are you wearing a bra tonight, ma'am? Yes, sir. Do you have anything in your yoga pants? No, sir. Look straight forward for me. Triple five cent cover traffic. Triple five, Alright, I'm gonna walk you to the side of my car, okay? There'll be Montgomery and Brenda Street. Have a seat for me. Mexico 064, William Robert Charles. Back to Point Glenny Center. Montgomery, what's your car? There'll be Montgomery and Pennsylvania. Miss right? Yes, sir. Is your last name? Yes. Okay. So listen to me. I'm about to tell you something important. You're under arrest for driving under the influence of intoxicating alcohol and or drugs. The New Mexico Implied Consent Act requires you to submit to a breath test to determine the alcohol content of your blood. After you take our test, you have the right to choose an additional independent test. If you choose to take this additional independent test, you have the right to a reasonable opportunity to arrange for a physician, a licensed nurse or laboratory technician or technologist who's employed by a hospital or a physician of your own choice to perform an additional chemical test. The cost of this additional test will be paid for by the law enforcement agency, which is the New Mexico State Police. Do you agree to take our test? No. <clears throat> I cannot force you to take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non-resident operating privilege for one year. If you are convicted in court of driving while under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Your right to speak to an attorney or remain silent does not apply to the requirement of New Mexico law that you take a breath test. Do you now agree to be tested? Yes, sir. Yes, you agree or yes, you refuse. Yes, I refuse. You refuse to be tested? Yes, sir. Okay, so right now I consider your actions a refusal to be tested. Do you have anything in that car that you want to go with you? No, sir. Do you have a wallet? Yes, sir. 
Yes, sir. Is it in the car? Yes, sir. Where would it be located? It would be in the front seat with my purse. Okay. I got you, I got you. Have a seat for me. So this is a brand new mouthpiece. It's never been used by anybody else. All right, ma'am. So this thing's going to go through its calibration checks to make sure it's operating within calibration. Um, once it goes quiet, that'll be your opportunity if you want to provide a breath sample tonight. If you still refuse to provide a breath sample, like I said, it, it would then at that point be an aggravated DWI charge. You will have about three minutes once it goes quiet um, to think over your decision. Once those three minutes are up, it's going to time out and it'll be final. Okay. All right, ma'am, right now is that time if you would like to provide a breath sample. Take one big, strong breath. It's going to have to be a steady, consistent blow. Go ahead and blow. So it's not nearly hard enough. So, so hold on for one second. Take a deep breath. Make a seal with your lips. You'll hear a tone start. Once the tone starts, continue to blow until the tone stops, okay? Once you hear the tone, that, that means that you're blowing hard enough just like you're blowing up a balloon. Go ahead and blow, 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 keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. So, so try it one more time, okay? It's gotta be consistent. Keep going, 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 keep going. Would it help you if you stand up? Okay, so it's got to be just one constant hard breath, okay? Deep breath. Keep going, 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 keep going. Stop. So it's going to ask for one more, just like you did. Is anybody expecting you at home tonight? No. Okay. You live by yourself, essentially? Okay. All right, ma'am. Right now is that time for the second breath? Just like the first time. Blow, 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 blow. Keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. Stop. So you blew a 0 .18, 0 .20, okay? Do you need the restroom? Stand up for me. Do you need water? 
Okay, we're gonna go right in this room. Would you like your phone? No. Face the wall, please. This wall right here, on your left. Let go. Have a seat on your left, just right behind you, right here. You said no phone, no water. 